And we're down, and we're dirty, and we're going in. What do we see? <laughs> and it looks like a succubus. Get her. And she... Wow. She's actually proving less difficult than the cultists. Oh, because my minions weren't trying to go crazy. <laughs> no, there's still one guy there. I'm gonna get the statue boss. Sire, that girl William the Paladin was going to marry, well, and she's my sister Velvet. <laughs> we don't speak. Speaking usually means she's got herself into some kind of trouble again. Judging by this place, Velvet's in it up to her silly little neck. Yeah, so, yeah, not spoiler, but, yeah, they're like, oh, there you go, there's the truth. Velvet is Velvet, and we're taking this. Hmm. Oh, yeah, that, that thing gets through even though it doesn't have clearance just fine. But no, when we had like a, this amount of difficulty in the sewer, nope, couldn't go through. <laughs> of course not. The sewer was just too insurmountable. What did we lose? We lost. Oh, we lost browns only. That's impressive. What does this item do even? Forget. It has been a while. This game is pretty old after all. Mm, magic sword. I love having a magic sword. Uh, I'm sorry. It's about you. We, I just needed my magic sword. We, we needed it. They say that uh, he summoned her to satisfy his, well, you know. What did that do? Uh, okay. I need something stronger. Let's see if we can go kill William. And then hopefully... Um, save this city from a paladin's libido. I never thought I'd say that, but I have. I have now said save the city from a paladin's libido. And he lowers it down because we killed his mistress, wife, I don't... What was that succubus to him exactly? Sex friend? Sex friend? Probably sex friend. I mean, what was Velvet to him then? I, William, you you are not a good person. You really fell from grace. Okay, let's get two more browns. No, I'm talking about four, but I prefer five reds but right now we have a little surplus of them and <clears throat> greens are oh and there's where of course our flag will go once we've beaten this area but first up let's break these boxes over here get some loot up yeah give us me that loot that loot is good our means are not at a good con a good percentage but you know what nope we're going in Come on, do that minion shake. His citadel party. Oh, 
Yeah, just like the halfling, he's partying. But his party's of a different you, nature. You! Didn't we leave you for dead in that godforsaken tower? You certainly should not be turning up at my party uninvited and flouting the dress code. So, there's our first hint. No, we are not the previous overlord. The secret? What are we? So, there were seven adventurers. Supposedly, one for each of the sins. No, there was an eighth. We are that man. We are the, one of the people that killed the previous overlord. And everyone else thought we were dead and left us for dead. Um, well, some of them left us for dead, supposedly. Or most of them thought we were dead. I don't know. I don't really know. If they thought we were dead or they just assumed we were dead. Considering the minions had to wake us up and all those other things, I can't really say one way or another. What, what the exact condition we were in. But yeah, the end result is that we... Um, we were assumed dead by our companions and we've taken up the mantle as the new overlord. Do not kill all my party guests. So, yeah, we had to murder all his party guests. Come on, come on, right over here, murder yourselves, murder yourselves for me, murder yourselves for me, murder yourselves, murder, come on, pull back, and yeah, that's basically the strategy, we gotta weed them out, okay, pull back, why do you stop to kill cattle? Uh... Let's swap over to Fireball. At least you're good for a little entertainment. I do hope you can stay the distance, peon! Oh god, I forgot that's what he does. It's been a while. Oh, he's a fucking troll. That's right, he's a troll. Oh, mother. There can be beauty in pain. Ha! Huh? I can't believe I spent so long defending the right and the just. I thought fun happened to other people. Okay, what is murder, life murder your way through a guys. pain. Pull back. They die to give me pleasure. I also get a lot of red souls Do here. Not kill all my party guests. We're no, we are. We definitely are. These guys are kind of annoying, especially when we need to go back and restock right stop now. To kill cattle? Hold back. I can't tell you how good it feels to throw off the shackles of morality and antiquated dogma. Reds. Browns. Reds. Browns. 
Yep, they give us a little restock station because they closed the door behind us. Murder them all! Let's just restock fully up on reds because we lost a lot there. Ah, oh, because I forgot William here. William's a dar dar gorse dorn troll. That's what he is. Fights like a troll. But he's way faster than them. And he teleports away when you try and kill him. And we're here now. Oh, final chamber. Yay. Final chamber. Oh, yeah, the two succubi. Focus on her, let's... Oh, gosh. Succubi suck. They just... Oh, man. Just die already. Die. Oh, my goodness. She is not... Die. 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 Oh, my goodness. She is not... There we go. Now she's dead. We've lost... Oh, good. These guys have just been busy building this one down. Go to get her. Murder. Okay, there we go. That's what I like to see. That... Okay. You have a little skill, peasant. But do not overestimate it. I have more. You know, I don't really... I, I'd argue... Oh, we didn't actually lose anyone. Oh, and we got some red souls out of this. Nice. Is that a... Yep, it is. Succubi stained glass. Well, now we've seen... Not everything. Maybe everything? I don't know. Oh, yeah, we need to get this. And tell that greedy dwarf king that he can't have his wedding presents back. If I'm not going to have a wedding, I at least want presents. Oh, yeah. Uh, that's velvet. So, there you go. Velvet is the more corrupt angle. Rose is the less corrupt. So, velvet is neutral evil. So, if you're playing corruption, you're not chaotic evil. You're neutral evil because you're still an overlord. Whereas, you're playing Rose, you're playing lawful neutral or lawful evil as an overlord. If you don't know D&D terms, that basically means you're being pragmatic, but probably still fairly evil. And we're the over here. taught me how to seek my freedom. I won't let you take it, you uncouth lout. Never! So the wizard, for reference, was not one of our party. Oh, um, there was no wizard in the party. The closest to a mage was you. You were the mage. Probably Oberon as well, but Oberon's an elf, so I don't think he counts as one. But the wizard is watching. He is always watching. Uh, so who the heck is this wizard that William is talking about? Who is he, and why is he important? Oh, there you are, William. Gosh darn it! Stop running away. There are no pleasures greater than those of the flesh. So, yeah, the wizard basically took what everyone's weaknesses were and tried to corrupt them after, you know, the whole killing the last overlord. You no know, murder, a murder. And violent death. Now that's the way to start a party. <laughs> yeah, William is a lot easier than our old halfling friend. God, man. Think about how long we were, must have been out. Because, you know, the halfling was a halfling. We were... I may have fallen, muck dweller, but what a ride! There we go, and he's dead. And we killed a paladin. Well, a fallen paladin. And now... Now it happens. Now. 
Yeah. He was that concentrated evil at that point. That is an evil, evil person. Yeah, he went from being a paladin to be Sir William the Black. Oh, and look, that guy's got the staff. And that guy's got the uh, rod for opening up the gate. So now we get the choice between Velvet or Rose. The choice is obvious, Rose, because we're being not corrupt. But if you're being corrupt, then you go with Velvet. But even then, Rose is probably a better choice. Uh... Oh yeah, we, we use his cane as the thing. <laughs> Let's say hi to Velvet, then leave her. Because if you take her to the tower, then she replaces Rose. But yeah, here's Velvet. Well, hello, dark stranger. The rumors do not do you justice. But I love you her evil me bed. A some little pixies. And this is also you another thing. Really She's just like Rose and she calls the minions pixies or like you Next things. time, make it something shiny and expensive. Now, let me thank you properly. She's obviously fine. She can find her own way out. Oh, she's quite the tasty treat, sire. Oh, Narl, go to your corner. I'm going down there to sort this out. Sire, the tower can only accommodate one mistress, unfortunately. Narl, 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 we're not, we're not that type of person. Come to play the concerned big sister. Come to spoil my fun. You should know, Sire, that while you were out, I found a way to strengthen your brown and blue minions. Common bribery, Rose. I thought that was beneath you. Yeah, so that's how they tell you which one of them does what. They tell you, so we're taking Rose. Because I like Rose better as a character. Oh, sorry. She'll nag you to death. I appreciate and it makes much more loyalty, sense for Velvet. To Pay be no attention winning. to her. She's all talk. Yeah. Rose is just a more interesting person. And I believe we have another Mistress cut Rose this, so. has already upgraded your brown, sire. You can upgrade your blues in your private quarters. Mm. And Rose upgrades one for free. Come on, my lovelies. Pay attention or Auntie Rose will have to hurt you. My sister has some issues, sire. Father was never there and mother spoilt her. Her own puppy, her own pony. No sheepy. Guess who had to clean up the blood? Speaking of cleaning, this place could do with a woman's touch. You should really get it looking a bit more homely. To be fair, I came back to it and it was destroyed. And I was one of the original heroes that destroyed it in the first place. And I kind of woke up unconscious. And was sulfur was rubbed in my eyes. And you know what? Fair enough. This place could use an upgrade. We'll be right back, audience.